Hi everyone, welcome back, or welcome to my channel if you're new. So this is my first official video talking about just girl groups. If you've been a viewer of my videos for a long time, you might remember I used to actually store other groups in my BTS videos as well. And I thought I would finally show my girl group collection because I am primarily a BTS and girl group stan. That's just the music that I like the most. So I figured I would show my girl groups. The first binder I have is the Pink Luca Lab Composition Book. And the second one I have is an A5 from Amazon. I will link it below um, in different, there's like a whole bunch of colors that this comes in, but I really, really love this. And yellow is my favorite color, so I picked yellow. And pink was just my other binder that I have because I have two other composition books, but they're from my BTS collection. And this was kind of what I had left, so. None of my girl groups are thoroughly collected. I just kind of collect what I want slash what I can because BTS are my primary collection, so I put most of my money and my attention towards that collection. So my girl groups are often put on like the back burner, but recently with all the newest girl groups debuting, it's been fun to like get back into girl group collecting. So I'm gonna show you what's in this binder first and then we'll move into the pink one. When we open it up, the first person you see is Dahyun of TWICE. Dahyun is my main bias in TWICE. Uh, I love her to pieces. <laughs> She's been one of my top girl biases for as long as I can remember. Fancy was my first comeback um, with them and it was just so much fun. I loved Fancy era. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so I have been with them since Fancy but I didn't start collecting until Eyes Wide Open. So. Um, the first thing is I have this little Dahyun Polaroid in this pocket and then I have this Jungyeon um, Eyes Wide Open card because she looks like she's peeking out and it's so cute. I love this card so much. Um, for twice I tend to keep my pulls but I also try to collect Dahyun as much as I can so for Eyes Wide Open I do have her complete and this is kind of the layout I went with. I like doing diagonals. And this is one of my favorite photo cards. Honestly, Eyes Wide Open have some of my favorite photo cards for her. Like, she's gorgeous. She's one of the best selfie takers. And I truly love her cards so, so much. Like, every time Toys has a comeback, I'm just so excited to see Dahyun's cards. Like, they're just top tier. And then you'll see, like, some of her Eyes Wide Open cards aren't here. But that's just because they're in a different spot. But these were, like, my top faves. So I kept them at the front. Then we move into Taste of Love, which um, you'll start to see more of my other biases. So my second bias is Mina. This is my Taste of Love setup. Um, I didn't collect Dahyun fully for that. I only have three cards for her, um, but I just picked like my favorites. And uh, I kept my pools. I love Nyon so much uh, and Jihyo. Like I just, I love the girls so much. So I keep a lot of my pools and then just try to collect my favorite cards. So that was Taste of Love, and then we move into Formula of Love, and I collected, once again, I collected my favorite cards of the era, so I collected these cards. And then we go into the most recent comeback, which is between 1 and 2, and I just kept my pools and also collected Daihyun fully. So I pulled Penguin Mina, and I literally screamed, because Penguin Mina just means so much to me and I wanted this card so bad and um Dayan with her little chocolate it's so cute because it's actually like raspberry dark chocolate which is one of my favorite chocolates ever so she really did that for me and Nyan is just the cutest human ever I wanted to collect Nyan solo as well but I just didn't have the funds at the time of her solo but I do love her solo so much pop literally song of the year <laughs> um so I do have more cards I wanted to collect Momo a few cards from Momo as well, but I just didn't pull her, so I didn't feel like <laughs> trying to find it. But um, I did pull Momo for my message card and my target card, so I'm happy to have her there. And I do have the rest of Dahyun's cards. And then I have this Geo. <laughs> and then these are some like extra Twice cards that I have that I got from like past sets. Because at one point I did want to collect Daihan pretty thoroughly. I just have some few cards that I like. And that's pretty much it for Twice. I have some pre-order benefits and some other cards back here. 
for Stacy. I love Stacy. They're my Stacy girls. I've been with them since debut. Um, I don't collect them though, just because again, pricing. And also, I have a bad habit of having two biases and that really hurts me in collecting <laughs> because it's so hard to just collect one member, but it's also really hard to collect two. But my two biases are Suman and Isa. So my friend was so, so, so sweet and gifted me these, which are pre-order benefits from younglove.com. So I just have these two cards and yeah, that's pretty much it for my Stacy collection. <laughs> um, and like I said, I have random cards back here. So what I'm planning to do with the rest of this binder is hopefully I can get more Stacy cards in the future to put them in here. And then I also plan on possibly collecting some of my favorite cards for Nmix and um, new jeans, but those are kind of up in the air. I've also thought about collecting Purple Kiss, but these are just ideas and um, I'm not quite sure if I'm going to be doing them. So we'll move on to the pink binder. So before we go into the pink binder, I do want to talk about my girlies, the Seraphim. So this is a page I made because I had planned to make pages for all of my girl groups and to kind of put them in my binder as cover pages. Um, these are my biases in La Seraphim. Um, Sakura and Kazaha are my top two and Yeonjin is my third. I love her so much and I love all three of these girls. I love this group. If I could collect OT5, I would. Um, I literally love La Seraphim so much because I am an Eyes 1 stan. If you remember, Eyes 1 used to be my old girl group and Chewan and Sakura are in Eyes 1. <laughs> so I've been with them since Eyes 1 and I just am so happy that they're thriving in La Seraphim. Anti-Fragile was such a good album and just all around a great, great time. Um, but yeah, this was a page I made and I really love it, <laughs> but I don't have any of their cards. So that is the one thing. Um, when their debut happened, I just didn't have the money to collect them and then they've just gotten more popular as time has gone on. Therefore, their prices have gone up and they're also a hype group. They will be in this binder when I do get some of their cards because in this binder is like my old girls basically. So in here is primarily WJSN and I've, but it's not really I've, it's Eugen. So it's my Starship Binder, <laughs> um, but when they are added into this, it won't be the Starship Binder anymore, so it's more of just my olds. Um, so for WJSN, I collect Dawan and Unso. I try to collect both of them, but in the collecting community, um, Dawan is extremely easy to, com to collect versus Unso, who's on the more expensive side. So I do have Unso right here. She's literally the cutest person ever. Um, and I do have two signed Dawan cards. And I just want to thank Erica Cherry Chim because she's the one who really got me into WJSN. I had already been listening to them since like 2019, but I really got into them like about a year ago. So I just want to thank her <laughs> for really getting me into them and helping me find my new old girl group. Um, so for WJSN, I just kind of collect what I want at the moment. So these are kind of what I have. This is As You Wish for the summer. Neverland. I pulled Subin and I had to keep her. This is a pre-order benefit from K-Town. Then we have more Neverland. Unso and Dawan have a unit together. It's the cutest thing ever and I'm so happy to have it. Um, Dawan and Luda. This is literally me and Erica. And then we go into Unnatural. This was my first Dawan card and also my first WJSN card. And then we go into Sequence and I tried to collect both of them, but Sequence is not done yet. So again, I'm just kind of collecting like my favorites. Um, these are some pre-order benefits and more pre-order benefits. And then we have some non-album and then we have, this will be for their new photo book. So when that comes, I will put them in there. And then we have WJ's and the Black. This is my favorite card in existence. Like, oh my God. 
and I pulled this Sola so I kept her and I pulled this unit as well so that's it for WJSN I do have um chocomi cards but they're not in this binder I actually think they're at home but I do have chocomi and I love 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 chocomi so I just love all the WJSN units like they're just so good WJSN are just the best girls if you don't listen to them or don't know much about them please look into them they're just so so great and i adore them so then we move into yujin who was in eyes one and now she's in ive so i have some of her eyes one cards um that i kept after i like downsized a little bit and this is from one rick this is from one reeler and then we move into her ive cards this is from 11 and this is from love dive and then i have one more love dive card on the way and two of after like coming i'm just picking like my favorite cards once again so for the girl groups it's a very common theme that i just collect what i want and i don't really stick to a template because there's just too many cards in existence for me to collect all of these groups and collect two members of bts i just collect what i enjoy for my girls and uh, i really really enjoy doing it it's been so much fun and I can't wait to add more because I have more cards on the way and I'm so excited. So that is my girl group collection. I may do more storing videos for the girl groups or I might combine them with my BTS ones, I'm not quite sure. But yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time. Bye!